friends and welcome to the dusty and beautiful beach town of Santa Teresa. Located on the west coast of the Nicoya Peninsula, this trending beach town is becoming one of the most popular places to visit in Costa Rica. Far away from city lights and airports, reachable by dusty roads, this beach town really gives you the feeling that you are at the end of the world. With a large white sanded beach filled with palm trees and great waves, this is really a surfer's and backpacker's paradise, but also an oasis for digital nomads and young expats. Besides the obvious and surfing lessons and tours, there are plenty of hit places and restaurants to be found in Santa Teresa. And of course also the occasional beach party and jungle parties. But one of the best features of this back into the jungle beach town is probably the sunset. But we'll get back to that in a minute. Despite the fact of being a surfer's paradise, do the rip currents, it's not really advised to swim. So swimmers, be aware. As the roads in Santa Teresa are unpaved, you will see a lot of quads, which is actually a great idea. And although the main road towards town is mainly paved or in good conditions, the last part is really sandy and really dusty, for which reason it's really recommended to come here with a 4x4. To get to the Nicoya Peninsula itself, there are two ways. The first and easiest way is taking the ferry from Punta Arenas to Paquera. You can take your car, but you can also go by feet. Another way is to drive around the shore, which will give you a complete different landscape than we've seen in the center of Costa Rica, where instead of the lush green jungles, you get to enjoy the wild wild west atmosphere. And it's also a great opportunity to practice your karaoke skills. As nobody can hear you. This route also goes along La Puente de la Amistad, or in English, the Bridge of the Friendship, which connects the Nicoya Peninsula to the mainland. So, what would you prefer? A quick trip with the boat or the scenic route along the coast? Let us know in the comments below. Back to Santa Teresa. And while I prepare my drone to show you this beautiful beach from above, Here's something you can do that helps our channel grow and get our video viewed to more people. Make sure to smash that like button, subscribe if you haven't yet and activate the notification bell to stay updated on new uploads. And I must say, although sunsets are beautiful in general, watching the sun go down on the white sanded beach filled with palm trees while surfers pass along really has a magical touch to it, which makes Santa Teresa an ideal place to do that. And while we enjoy the final glimpse of this beautiful beach, for now, we prepare ourselves for the long drive ahead to the final area of a road trip around Costa Rica, the Pacific Coast, where we're going to show you the best places to see. But that's a story for next week.
Thank you very much for making the time to check out our video. Make sure to hit the subscribe button and check out our playlist to see more Costa Rica and other travel related content. Pura Vida!